So I just recently moved into my new apartment in Dubai. Today we're going to follow how I'm working as an AI engineer and content creator on the sideline. So this is a typical day in my life where I do a bunch of work. I'm sitting at the desk. We will go into some of the technical details with the projects that I'm working on and also the content creation projects and what I'm doing when I'm not working. So pretty much every day I'm working eight to 12 hours, depending on day, what I'm doing and so on. I always try to go to the gym every single day and also go to the pool, go off a walk just to get a break from sitting in front of the screen and also the monitor the whole day. So right now I'm specifically working on my AI career program where I'll help people like build up their freelance business, land AI machine learning jobs and basically just build this whole community. We have all the technical courses in there and so on. So I've been spending a lot of time recently on developing them. I'm also working on some new code projects where we basically have some computer vision systems that I'm going to use for my videos. So I'm going to create a whole playlist with the Jetson Nano, how we can run update detection, update tracking and so on real time on that edge device. So we have whole frameworks with the DeepStream framework. Everything is configuration based. So I'm going to create a bunch of videos. I'm preparing a full tutorial and a whole playlist covering that. So recently I've also been getting way more into content creation been upgrading my cameras, my quality in the videos and so on, and just been focusing way more on the editing. So I've tested out this new video editing tool, which is called Vimora by Wondershare. So it's actually like a pretty awesome tool. It has all the editing and so on, but also some very cool AI features that I like to use and also just to generate ideas, generate music for the videos and so on. So we have everything in just one product suite. So I've been using Filmora to edit this whole video here that you're going to see in this vlogging type video. So they also the sponsor of the video and they have a bunch of cool features that I want to test out. So they have like AI co-pilot editing. You can ask it specific things if you want to change the lighting and so on. You can have AI text-based editing as well. AI thumbnail generator that's really good if you're doing content creation, especially for YouTube and so on. And the last cool AI feature is the music generator. So all the music in this video has been generated with the AI music generator. So you're going to download it, check out the different tools and so on if you're getting into video editing or if you just want to play around with it on your own. So throughout the day, when I want to take a break, I basically just go to the pool, could be like 20, 30 minutes just to get out there, get some sun, could be that I go for a walk to start with. So right now I'm just laying at the pool for 20 minutes. There's also like a sauna and steam bath in the apartment and in the tower here. So that's really nice to have. Good way to take a break, reset your brain and so on when you're sitting in front of your monitor in your office 10, 12, 14 hours every single day. So I really love this new apartment here. It's a beautiful view over the pole of the mirror here in Dubai. So it's just stunning from every single room in the apartment and just sitting there at your desk, being able to look out at the view, it just motivates me so much, pushes me to just keep on improving myself, be better at the work that I'm doing and so on. So it's a very motivational factor. Also just get a lot of light into it. It's a beautiful view both by day, but also at night. Sometimes I also just like to switch up my environment, go to cafes and so on to work for 30 minutes, an hour or so on. Could be that I'm writing some video scripts, writing emails, preparing some stuff and so on. And I just like to do that at a cafe, have a coffee and just sit there and chill for some time and using that as a break as well from sitting at the desk all day long. So the project that I'm working on now is to build a full scale computer vision system that can run in real time, everything configuration based, so we can get out of our Jupyter notebooks and into production significantly faster. Because one of the main problems when we're doing AI models, computer vision models and so on, is that we don't know how to take them into production, how to deploy the models, run inference, extract the results and make it do useful stuff out there in the real world. And also the hardware requirements that you need, the cameras connect all of that. We can have everything up and running in our own Python scripts, our Jupyter notebooks, get the visualizations with the OpenCV windows, but it's a whole nother world once we want to take our models, deploy them into production and run them out there in the real world world. So that's what I'm focusing on now, building up whole pipelines that can take video streams. Everything is configuration based. You can have video files, RGBS streams, webcams, and so on. You just connect it to the system. It will do all the processing based on the NVIDIA DeepStream framework. Everything is optimized from NVIDIA, CUDA, Tensor RT. You can take a custom ULV8 model or whatever update detection model that you have, convert it into Tensor RT, run the inference with the Tensor RT engine. 
using DeepStream, connecting all the video stream together. It's going to take care of all the synchronization. Everything is configuration based, so you can just specify the models, the tracking, all the different parameters, the video files and so on. It's going to connect them as a pipeline and you can even integrate custom Python scripts into the system. So this is how you can build like a full scale computer vision system. So that's basically what I'm working on on this sideline right now, besides my full-time position, but I won't be able to talk about those projects or disclose any of the things that I'm working on there because I'm doing research on internal products, doing proof of concepts and so on for different companies um, in my full-time position. So in the evenings, I also record videos for other companies. I'm working together closely with Ultralytix. So right now I'm also creating a video about how we can run inference with DeepStream on an NVIDIA Jetson board. So that's what I'm setting up here in my office. I both have a setup specifically just for the Jetson boards. So I can have my Linux system over there in the corner. I can just go over there, don't have to switch anything. And then I have my main MacBook setup, Windows setup and so on at my main desk. So I can easily swap around, go from one computer to the other and just make it more efficient, the work that I'm doing, but also be able to context switch faster. In the evenings when I don't want to code anymore, or do content creation, also do a lot of trading and investing. Pretty much spend an hour, two hours on that every single day when the markets are open. It's just a very nice interest of mine that I've been doing for three to five years now, pretty much every single day when the markets are open. So all of these things here is pretty much what I'm doing in the week days, in the weekends. It's a bit different when the markets are closed, when I don't have my full time position and so on. I go out, chill a bit more, do some more sports and so on, but I still work a ton even in the weekends. So this is a pretty standard day in my life and I teach everything inside my AI career program how to do freelance work, set up your whole business, all the technical courses are available in there. We have the whole community with the week live calls where I help out every single one of them personally, how you can get the work out there, build your personal brand so you can start get way more opportunities on your side as well, because that's pretty much everything that you need. And also what has given me all of the opportunities that I have now at an early age.